Hello and welcome to another Fishing Planet video. This is a Christmas Eve special for Fishing Planet Christmas 2020. And it's really just to catch up on where I'm at. I haven't made a video for Fishing Planet for a few days, so I thought I would just make a, uh, a quick video. I partly haven't made any videos because for the last two days I've been taking part in the um, Christmas Giants uh, tournament. I've uh, actually been doing that on my other account, on my uh, Microsoft account. And um, come reasonably close, 32nd in both the first two qualifiers with one to go. And uh, Unfortunately, on the Microsoft account, it's the top 20 that get through. So um, I have to say Christmas Giants is not one of my best tournaments. Uh, so I'm not expecting great things. Although Canic is probably one of my favourite waterways, and that's the uh, waterway for the final qualifier. So you never know. So wish me luck on that one. Also had a, a go at a few... Um, custom competitions to get my bait coins up a little bit, which hasn't improved things massively, but it's kept things going. And as per my last video, I have been concentrating on the crappies more than anything, only because um, we now know that that unlocks the ability to get tokens on a daily basis still involves traveling and you don't even get the tokens by visiting the uh, bags it turns out you have to then wander around the uh, location finding sort of fairy dust or something i don't know anyway that's where we're at with the uh, crappies as you can see unfortunately although the green is uh, well within almost within 20 or so the red, as you can see, is not even halfway there yet, so that's going to take some doing, but um, I'm getting there gradually with that. And with the gobies, I'm very nearly there on the red and the green, but still 20 off on the blue. But I think with a bit of a concerted effort, I can, um, I can get that done. One thing that I have... Um, found out and decided that it would be a good idea to feed back on uh, was over the last few days things have changed they have patched the game so that the ability to mix the ground bait is now not possible so if you go to try and mix two types i don't know whether i can do this here i should be able to um if i go to the ground bait and then um Go to an empty recipe. If I put any cookie base in of any amount, I then can't put anything else in. I can't put active feeder in to go with it. So what they've basically done is realised that people were allowed, were being allowed to catch um, fish using small amounts of the cookie bait, and they don't want you to do that, obviously, because they want you to buy the DLCs with um, the cookie bait in or the uh, mega cookie ground bait uh, so they have put a stop to that so effectively you can only get five snowballs worth if you like or hand casting balls worth of mega cookie ground bait which i think is a bit um a bit off to be honest uh but there you go you um you know they've obviously they've got to make their money but it seems uh it does seem to me they're getting a little bit too greedy now but uh there you go still a very good game and plenty you can do without um without spending money so far i've got away with spending bait coins um and i certainly wouldn't be looking to spend any actual cash um but uh yeah it's um I've got um, plenty of tokens, but it's still going to need plenty more uh, to uh, to finish this mission. Still looking at the 
Um, Araku, there's a long, long way to go with that. I think I probably will go to Maron or somewhere like that, where I think there's a method of fishing where you pretty, pretty much only get those fish. Um, so yeah, that's my plan with that. While I'm here, I'm just going to do one uh, fish here. I don't actually mind what I catch. I am here at Lesney Villia, um, but to be honest, I don't really mind uh, what I uh, what I get if I get crappies. That's good. You'll notice that I've uh, turned the music off. There's two reasons for that. Um, one is that um, I'm getting highly fed up with the music and secondly when you try and make a YouTube video and publish it uh, the owners of the Christmas music want royalties and um, yeah well I'm not going to say any more about that um, I'm getting pretty fed up with the music didn't really like it very much in the first place and um, stopping people from posting videos with the music in when they don't even want the music in there probably um, is uh, yeah it's not not great but everyone's got to make their money somewhere I guess so actually it's quite nice because it takes away the bleeper sound and you can see the lights still and you still get the uh, the ringing um, and when things are going pretty frantic um, you don't really want the bleepers going bananas because what you really want to hear is when the um, bells are going like like that instance. Um, so yeah, that's actually in a way quite good. Um, so there's a blue, much needed blue. Nice and peaceful. So we might just get a red or a green and uh, that's another blue be nice to complete the first actual target in terms of uh, number of fish on the video that's a green, so uh, one short on the green now and one short on the red. That's a much needed crappy, so that's good. Not going to complain about that. And I'm still getting a fair few. Um, Arakus here as well, which is really not a problem. That's a red crappy, which is even better because that's what I'm most short of on that mission. I did find that um, using leeches at um, Lone Star produces zero gobies, or almost zero gobies, and um, only crappies and Duraku, so that's quite good to know if you've already done the gobi one. And there is the first, hooray, there is the first gobi colour knocked off the list. I suspect we'll continue to catch lots of red ones. Probably this is a red one. No, that's a blue one, that's good. And I did actually change the hook size uh, at Emerald uh, up to hook one. You can see that's what I'm using at the moment, and I haven't bothered to change that back. I was interested to know whether uh, it would mean that I would catch less of the smaller fish, the gobies here. And I think it, it has, I think that's uh, exactly what's happened. Um, and I'm quite happy with that because, um, as I say, I really want to complete the, the crappy one more than anything um, first. 
but I think it's a case of probably fishing at some locations knowing you're going to get all of them and then at some point you're going to have to try and um, narrow it down and fish for the specific fish that you want to complete your mission. So there's a red one which is no use to us. But I do know at least there is one location I can go to where I will catch as long as I have leeches on, a hook one on. Um, I will catch almost zero gobies and as I say that's uh, Lone Star. You can also go to Emerald uh, for catching the crappies, or predominantly crappy, uh, crappies. I have had very little luck with the ground bait system anyway. Um, even mixing it, as I say, you've got to mix it full, full strength. You can't dilute it with the other anymore. Uh, there's the green one gone. So now all I need is another 14 blue ones. And I'm still quite interested to see what I get in terms of the the blue bag, because the I think the red bag is um, I forget which way around it is now, but this gives you the um, the access to the other coloured bag. Oh, there's a blue one that's handy. Yeah, I would strongly recommend, or highly recommend, unless you actually like the Christmas music, I would uh, thoroughly recommend turning the environment volume slider down in your audio. That gets rid of the Christmas music. And also, it does, for me, make it easier to spot which rod is going and whether there's actually a fish there. Now, the other thing to mention is that I believe I was watching someone, I don't know whether it was KP Shimino or Sabi, I think it was probably KP, and he said that if you can get the ground bait um, working, then the pools of the steam or the magic dust or whatever it is, the stuff you can see in front of me at the moment, um, is actually coloured with the ground bait. The different pools are covered in with different you can see the little um, blobs of color coming up um, and that gives you an indication as to which color fish you are uh, you're gonna get in that pool so that's maybe worth looking into as well as I say I haven't had very much luck at all certainly fished at emerald with the ground bait and caught some festival fish but it's a fraction of the number of fish you catch in total you catch lots of normal fish as well um, that's throwing it in by hand as is uh, shown in the instructions so yeah i think it's going to be a while before i get these final gobies very welcome red crappy. The other thing to note is that although the money isn't brilliant, uh, you do get some reasonable money certainly for the crappies and when you're catching as many as, uh, as this, I think it was 114 for that red and 117 so it's over 100 for each and uh, so you are making a little bit of the money back that you'll be using for travelling and um, licenses and things. 
I've got licenses at the moment, of course, on both systems for the sites at which the um, Christmas Giants tour is happening. me quite so much to travel around those venues but so White Moose Lake is one of the venues and Canic is one of the venues and those are two venues where you want to be picking up as a blue one you want to be picking up the snow for the um, the separate challenge the snow holiday or whatever it's called where you get the snowman cap Anyway guys, I'm going to be doing the, uh, the Christmas Giants third and final qualifier later today, so I may make another video perhaps tomorrow or the next day, but a Merry Christmas to you all, and um, good luck with the quest and any other fishing planet um, fishing that you're doing, and I will see you hopefully before too long. Bye for now.